2020. It's Terrific Tuesday. My name is Tacovia Hayes, broadcasting from WPFE. And I'm Jamal Gillette. We, we are from Miss Johnson's and Miss Holmes' fourth, fourth grade, grade class. class. Thanks for tuning in. It's a new day, Tigers. Let's take a moment to reflect on positive thought. Please stand and raise your right hand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Come to school every day so you can earn a, a golden ticket, a golden ticket. Tigers, are you wearing your uniform to school every day? You don't want to miss the next uniform celebration. Pizza parties, ice cream sundaes, root beer floats. You never know what it's going to be. Tigers, would you like to be featured on the morning announcements? We want to know about what you are reading. Create a Flipgrid video using the code on the screen telling us about what you are reading. What is your book about? Would you recommend it to a friend? We want to hear all about it. Attention all 4th and 5th grade students. Would you like to spotlight a classmate at our monthly meetings? Don't forget to pick up an I Wish My Principal New form from the main office to highlight something that a friend or a classmate has done. Attention all 4th graders, are you earning AR points to help your class win the 4th grade reading challenge? Remember, the class with the most AR points for the month of January will win a pizza party. Let's take a look at the scoreboard. Tigers, don't forget the snack chat is here every Friday. Bring money for a delicious treat. After school. Good morning, my Tigers, and welcome to another week in the forest. Miss Gunner is so happy to see you. We got some things going on Tuesday, boys and girls. We need you and your parents here for dinner and data. It's from 4 to 6 o'clock. You come, you, your parents get to talk, and they get to see your scores, how you're doing on the star, how your grades are doing, how your attendance is doing. You get to have free dinner. We're going to have some spaghetti and some salad and some garlic bread and some lemonade. And guess what? If your parents come, y'all may win an Amazon Echo. We got two big baskets of prizes that we're giving away. We got gift cards we're giving away. Maybe your mama will take you shopping. Tell your mama, your daddy, your auntie, your grandma, somebody, come back on Tuesday for dinner and data at 4 o'clock. And then on Thursday and Friday, congratulations to all those boys and girls. We're having awards day. We got people who are most creative. The honor roll, um, the writing wizards. We got the kids who know the most red words, all kind of things. We're giving awards, awards, awards on Thursday and Friday. They're in your classroom. Ms. Gunner's going to be walking around, congratulating, taking pictures. You all are celebrities. So job well done. Look where I am, boys and girls. This is our school word wall. Every Wednesday is word wall Wednesday. Ms. Gunner bought some more gum for our gumball machine in the front office. If you know a word, when you go to the cafeteria, you tell one of the people on duty one of these words, say what it means, use it in a sentence, get you a special quarter, and come and get you some gum or candy from the front office. So let's see. Did y'all notice that they are separated by parts of speech? These are adjectives. Adjectives describe. You can just say the lady, or you can say the pretty lady, because pretty is an adjective. Look at this, let's see. Does anybody know what enormous means? Enormous means big. What about over here? These are adverbs. Miss Gunner, what's an adverb? An adverb 
it is linked to a verb. So I can say I ran, or I can say I ran quickly. Quickly, adverbs usually end in L-Y. Look at these words, let's see. What about abruptly? I could be running and then I go. That means I stopped abruptly. Look over here, these are our verbs. Let me see one of my favorite ones, dangle. She dangled a carrot in front of the bird. Dangle, and over there are our nouns. We know the noun, it names a person, place, a thing. So when you walk through the commons area, look at these words, look them up, know the definitions, know the root word, use it in a sentence, and come and get you some gummy candy every Wednesday. And look at this. Don't forget, I need you to earn those live school points. Let me see, risk takers are winning. Open Mining is about to go on a field trip. Boys and girls, wear those lanyards, earn those live school points, follow the forest fire, put on those school uniforms, do your homework, answer the complete sentences. Y'all know the drill. Come to school every, every, every single day. All right, books, 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 books. Okay, this book is Mrs. Meyer is on fire. This is a 560 Lexile, one point. This is Mrs. Meyer. Mrs. Meyer goes to schools and she teaches all the kids about the danger of fires. But the kids notice that Mrs. Meyer is maybe a little crazy. She likes fire a little too much. Is Mrs. Meyer trying to help them or is she trying to make them be crazy like her and sister fires around the city? Come and get this book. This looks fun. This is Shaquille O'Neal, Little Shaq. We're playing basketball. Do you want to know about Shaquille O'Neal, how he was when he was a little boy, how he grew up, and how he became a grown man that makes millions of dollars? This book is a 590 Lexile level. You get 0.5 points. Come and get this book. Tell me about how Shaquille O'Neal became a famous basketball player making all that money. Boys and girls, I love you. Miss Gunner is so glad you're here. I want you to remember, be kind to each other. Keep your school nice and clean. Answering complete sentences. Let's make it a great day, the Peyton way.